Brian, so uh, you're dressed for summer. Beach gear, I am pretty much flying high right now because I had an amazing morning hanging out with the coolest kids on the beach, the lifeguards. Nice. The Red Bull Surf and Rescue Lifeguard Tournament is in Atlantic City today. The biggest lifeguard tournament. My voice cracked, and I don't feel puberty. You're so excited your voice is cracking. It's like, you know, puberty at 46. <laughs> wow. <laughs> the biggest lifeguard tournament in the region. Dozens of crews from as far away as New York City, as far south as Virginia Beach, are descending on Atlantic City. It is a spectacle to behold if you ever get to catch one of these tournaments. And this morning, sponsor Red Bull held an immersion kind of mock competition for VIPs and reporters. Not a lot of reporters yeah. showed up, actually. Wow. Why? My theory is that the newspaper reporters are too out of shape and the TV <laughs> reporters are too worried about muffing up their hair. That would so, be up their hair. Uh, chasing yes. news, baby. Absolutely. Right in the catbird seat. She went there. She went there. Chasing news right in the catbird seat. I finally pretty much had the run of this place. Got to spend some water time. The experts at their craft. Uh, first, I went out with Taylor Five. She's a member of the Longport Beach Patrol team, which won the cornerstone competition of this gig, uh, the swim paddleboard boat relay last year. No separate women's division for Five. So most of these patrols are putting their guys on the boats. She rode in the third round and moved them forward and got them up to the yep. finals. She rode in both. That's like unheard of. <laughs> Most of these guys are like, no, it's boats. Girls shouldn't row. Girls shouldn't row. <laughs> well, the team that won it all last year took home $15,000 worth of jet skis, trailers, and sled. It's because they got Taylor rowing. She showed me the paddleboard route out to the buoy and back. Ah, she's killing me already. I took a ton of spills. Let me try my knees. It's like. <laughs> I'm not coming back to work. That's it. Signing off for the last time of Chasing News. I headed out with Andre Baumgartel. His nickname is just Rooster. I'm also of the Longport Beach Patrol for my first ever trip rowing in the wooden life-saving boat. What was that? This was awesome. These boats, my great-grandfather was an uh, AC guard. They rode the same boats that we rode today. So it's that wooden life-saving boat, very unique to New Jersey. Most other places they've gone to fiberglass, but in New Jersey they use these. It gives kind of the local crews a home team advantage in this tournament. The man, kind of right, right equal with you on the seat, and then you're gonna lean back. Also, the rowing I do was on the, uh, you know, the machine at, at the gym. <laughs> but I got out there, and I'm like, this is like a bucket list moment. These classic Atlantic City white surf boat, you've seen them in postcards, 100 years old, and they're out there cruising along the beach. Man, I'm, I, I feel like I'm in bucket list territory right now, rowing an Atlantic, classic Atlantic City wooden lifeboat along the beach. So you in uh, better or worse shape than you thought you were? I'm in far worse shape. <laughs> yes. It's the fountain of youth. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> These guys are awesome. in great shape. <laughs> we're done, man. Right?